So now that we know what causes the differences in reaction rates, it's time we put that knowledge to good use. That's right, it is possible to actually influence the rate that a reaction is going at. So how do we increase a rate of reaction? Well, first of all, we can increase the rate of collisions. Even if only some of these collisions are effective, increasing the overall rate of collisions will result in a faster rate of reaction. After all, if you throw 100 water balloons at a target, even if some miss, you have a greater chance of hitting it than if you threw just one, right? We're going to try and give our reactions the best chance of being successful by throwing all of our resources at them. There are four basic ways of increasing the rate of reaction, and this video will cover two of them, increasing the concentration and increasing the surface area of the reactants. What does increasing the concentration of a reactant mean? Increasing the concentration means that there are more particles present of the reactant in a specific unit volume. For example, a curry with one chilli in it is tolerable, but increase the chilli count in the same amount of curry and you could be facing a long night. Increasing the concentration of one of the reactants in a reaction will increase the number of particles available to collide. The more particles there are packed into a small place, the more likely they are to stumble into each other. This increases the frequency of collisions and thus increases the rate of reaction. Increasing the surface area does a similar job. Think of surface area as the concentration of particles that are physically exposed to other particles. For example, if you want to dissolve a cube of sugar, the water can only react with the particles it can touch, those on the surface of the cube. No matter how much the very middle sugar granule wants to be dissolved, it's a lost cause if the water can't get to it. Pour a teaspoon of sugar in instead, and suddenly all of the sugar is accessible. Increasing the surface area of a reactant increases the rate of reaction in the same way the concentration does. The more particles there are to collide, the more chances there are that they will. 